Yo, what's going on and welcome back to another Genshin Impact video and today we are going to be looking at the even mountains tremble like little event thingy. <clears throat> I've been a little bit lazy so I haven't actually taken a look at this and I don't know exactly what it is. I know that it's a way to spend resin and to get some of these normal character ascension materials plus the the base artifacts. But I don't really know what's going on with this because I haven't taken a look at it. Now I meant to stay in there. When you hit um, go investigate, it brings you to this spot here, but there's another spot up here where it actually talks about or it looks like you would do the actual boss fighting. But I think we need to start by going to here and then we can figure out, like the boss might not unlock until we go down here and check out whatever is going on. I'm not exactly, like I think I've seen one of these dudes just randomly while I was running around and I killed him. It wasn't very difficult. It didn't seem like anything special. But I feel like that's not the full fight. There's probably a more difficult fight at that actual location. Now what's going to be here, I don't know. Maybe it's just a quest to go do the thing. Uh, Tian Chi, Chi Valley 2 is something wrong. Pleased to see you, though I certainly wasn't expecting to run into you today. Have you been to Tiang Chiu Valley or Nan... Jeez. Oh, Nan Tianmen? Nan Tianmen? Nan Tianmen? I don't know. The guild has been receiving a constant stream of reports about earthquakes in those areas. It was just a minor tremors at first, but they've been getting more and more serious since. Then not long ago we received word of a particularly strong earthquake that caused part of the mountains and ruins to collapse, revealing a gigantic cavern. So I do feel like one of these ruins, specifically the the chi, 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 the first one, the one that starts with the T, I feel like there was a passageway in it that I didn't know how to get to, and this might be that. The report also mentioned some unknown monsters have been sighted in the area. Based on the descriptions, they may well lead to none other than the Geo Vishaps and Primo Geo Vishaps that once terrorized Liwei. I don't know what I just asked him, I just clicked on it. Well, I'd like to ask you to head to Tian Chiu Valley to investigate that huge cavern and report on the impact of the earthquake and the surrounding environment. As for the monsters, if it's true that they're appearing in great numbers and we cannot afford to ignore them, we must decide on what countermeasures to take. Of course, this counts as official work for the guild, and you will be compensated accordingly. Okay, sure. I mean, there wasn't a no option. Thank you very much. Please stay safe. Okay, so let's... While we're looking at the map... Also... Oh, that's a weird camera thing. Hold on. Uh, we should register this quest. How do we register this quest? Which quest did I just accept? Not that. Not that this oh this is the other one so is there another one like that i have so many of these random world quests okay this one so we do have both of them now let's look at that other area because this is obviously one of them where is the other area he was talking about because there should be a second one that i guess i haven't seen right oh it's in here Okay, so we'll do that quest second. This quest will come first because he just asked us about it and then we'll figure out the second one. Uh, I mean, I guess teleporting up here is easier just because then we're on top of a mountain and we could just fly to it. Now, since it costs energy or resin, I'm sure that it'll be like either just a boss or like a domain that we have to enter. There's, there's going to be fighting, right? There's nothing that costs resin that isn't fighting. I'm running out of stamina. I should probably be a little bit more conservative here. <clears throat> Can I get past this Abyss Mage without him fighting me? Now the other question is, am I going to that point that it shows? Or am I going to the ruins and then getting to that under the mountains? feel like it should be under the mountains, but we'll start up here since we're already up here. There's a regular Geo Bishop. Not really what we're looking for. 
But maybe we should fight him? Because I don't know if we're supposed to fight this guy. He just broke my pillar that quickly? That's amazing. Okay, what's he doing? Oh, hello. He's so fast. <clears throat> He's not exactly easy to hit with Ganyu. What? Blasphemy. That didn't hit. Alright, hit him with this again. That didn't really do anything. He's so difficult to hit. That didn't kill. There we go. Uh, that guy appears to not be related to the situation. <clears throat> okay, so we're in the area. So obviously this is not it. Because I don't see any way to get into the ruins from here. So let's go down below. Like, is that an entrance? Is this what we're looking for? This looks pretty promising. Okay, this is pretty new. That looks like a boss down there. This is not what I was thinking of, though. <clears throat> Actually, now that I think about it, the thing that I was thinking of, I'm pretty sure I opened up at some point. So we could have gotten in from up top, huh? We got that Primo dude down there. Do we have any treasure around here besides the probable rewards for fighting Primo Vishep? <clears throat> I wonder if he's going to be on the difficulty of like a child or a Devalin or something. Or if he's going to be significantly easier. Next on the agenda. Okay, where did, exactly does this come out? Oh, there's some Geo Vishaps. Oh. See, this is one of the guys that I fought. We should fight him right now. I think that'd be a good choice. <clears throat> He's kind of like guarding the zone. That was a big one. He's kind of guarding the zone. So he seems like an important guy to at least like take out. I'm surprised there wasn't uh, a guy at the other entrance. That's a really annoying attack, but if we have uh, Zhongli's shield, it doesn't appear to be very threatening. Hello. What? <laughs> oh, he just like the regular Geo Bishops, he gets stunned when you have a shield and he hits you, I guess. See, he's not very difficult. And he didn't drop anything, which is weird. You'd think that they'd at least have something to drop. Where'd you go? Yeah, I think Zhongli is going to make this a lot easier. This guy didn't drop anything either. Okay. So let's go down here and fight this boss. We might have to go talk to it because, or, or it'll just activate and we'll have to spend the resin to get the rewards. I guess that's a more likely way that it'll work. But let's drop down there with Zhongli because Zhongli can take a beating. Uh, I don't think it's going to be very easy to make it not notice me. Also, the quest says defeat it, so... What is this stuff? It's like cool flowers. Although they are all two-dimensional, it, it would appear. I don't know, I mean, they kind of have something to them. <clears throat> as far as I know, there's no sneaking in this game, right? Huh? Like, we can walk. Oh. <laughs> well, that didn't really work. I wonder... Can we pause real quick? <clears throat> so we got two new monsters. <laughs> Let's just figure out how it works. <coughs> I think there's something in my throat. We'll just figure out how it works without... Can you be stunned, first of all? That's a negatory. Uh, I'm not sure what just happened there, but it seems cool. I don't know what's happening. My shield's already gone. Did I even use a shield? Get out of there. 
I wonder if we get like things for doing different elements on him because oh well we use the shield to counter his attack apparently so far Zhongli just seems really OP for this because he can't seem to do anything to Zhongli's shield can we hit this guy? Okay, that does not do damage while he's he's down there. Stabilize. Oh, I guess if we hit him during that, or if we just have a shield, I can't can't really figure it out. At the moment, I'm not quite sure, but it doesn't seem that difficult because of the shields that we do have. I don't know what these rocks do either. I think. Is that where the lava came from last time? Yeah, there's lava. Alright, give me a new shield. He's doing the, the land shark attack. He doesn't appear to have any complicated patterns, so... He's almost dead. Is this what's been causing those earthquakes? So powerful, so scary. Also, Zhongli is like extra OP against a guy like this because uh, with his new buff where his shield lowers their resistances, you just have to be like within 10 meters of him or something and it'll lower his resistance. Well, let's get a reward. Might as well. I got whatever this does. A crystalline. It's dropped by level 30 plus. Okay, so anyone who does this event. I can probably get this. Crystalline substance taken from a Primo Geo Vishap within it is contained the potential to become a dragon. These dull crystals are precipitated within the bodies of Vishaps sleeping in the mountains. Leeway folklore holds that they will gather power over many years, after which this crystal will at last replace their original heart and the Vishap will become a true dragon. Well, that seems concerning. One that can shake the mountains and split the earth. Oh boy. Got a cup. Alright, that cup is horrible. Don't look at that. We got some Mora. Um, I mean, other than... I don't know what we're supposed to do with this. Like, is it, what is it? It's a character level up material. Really? How does that work? Why don't we take a look? Okay, we got... Venti can currently be... It's not here. So what do you mean it's the character level up material? I don't know what that means. Can we find it in our inventory? So it's not a key item. Who's this? I got a lot of random stuff, huh? Uh, is it in here? Doesn't look like it. Oh, that's food. So maybe it means like a character ascension item? Yeah, it's right here, but like, yeah. So what, what the heck is this thing though? What character does it level up? Can it maybe be used for any character? Hold your horse. What if we try to ascend? We already have lots of basalt pillars. So that's not working. I don't know what to use that item for. <laughs> uh, maybe I'll look it up before we do the next one so I can kind of figure it out. But first, let's go turn in the quest and maybe he'll tell us what it's used for because I have no idea. Yeah, I think the reason I haven't leveled up uh, Ascended Zhongli or Noel is because I have enough Basalt Pillars, but I don't have enough of that uh, Jewel and I don't really feel like farming the, the Geo Hypostasis at the moment. I really should. It'd probably be a better use of my time than constantly trying to farm uh, Crimson Witch set for Klee. <clears throat> I'm starting to get some decent gear for her, but so far I don't have like the greatest pieces ever. It seems to be going a lot worse than it was for Ganyu, although Ganyu's pieces rolled pretty poorly, so there is that. A giant cavern ruin, high levels of monster activity, and a primo geo bishop within. Okay, I think I understand. Thank you for coming to me with this news. I'll handle the paperwork and make an official report. <clears throat> What's with that area? According to some text, Chien Chiyu Valley was once a prosperous settlement at some point in the ancient past. 
as to how it came to be that way it is now, it seems to have had something to do with the rampage of an ancient dragon king. Okay. There aren't a lot of details available about that incident, but legend has it that Rex Lapis and his Adepti eventually imprisoned it within some sort of Adepti realm. Its servants then fled into the depths of the earth and entered into a deep slumber, waiting for the day when the Dragon King would rise again. Yeah, does that mean the Dragon King's back? Those are just folk, folk tales, you know? No one knows how uh, true they are. Regardless, these constant earthquakes and the sudden appearance of those monsters are matters that demand our immediate attention. Right. Please take this as your payment. Thank you for the information provided. Well, he didn't tell us anything about the, the item. Um... So I guess we'll, we'll mark the quest. What was it called? Secret something? The secret of this? Where does that take us? This is probably what we'll do next time. So it's in this area. So there should be another one. Hopefully. But yeah, we'll do that next time. Um, if you know what that item does, maybe you can let me know. Otherwise, I'll probably look it up before we do the next one. Anyways, but either way, hopefully you enjoyed this one. And I will see you next time.